Miss Grant and we are at Jacob L. Adams Elementary School and this is my third grade class. We are going to be doing an activity today on place value. Okay guys, so let's talk about our place value chart. When we fill in and make a place value chart, what's the smallest place value that we have, that we know of? Tierra, the ones place. Okay. What comes after the ones place? What's the next smallest? Savion? Tens place. Tens place. If we keep going, Jada? The thousands. There's something before the thousands. The hundreds. The hundreds. Then we have the, what comes next, Aaliyah? Thousands. thousands. That's where we put our comma. We've got two more. You know what's coming next? Thousands. The ten thousands. Oh, mercy. The 10,000s. And then what's the largest place value, Jamari? 100,000. The 100. I don't know why it's doing that. The 100,000. Okay. So when we read a number in, in our place value chart, I'm going to fill this in. Just ignore the blinking, guys. It's a funny day. Okay, so who can read this number for me? If we split it into three groups, read me the first, the first part, only the underlined part. Jaden? Um, 380. Read the whole thing. 300,000. Read just this number. What does this part say? Oh, 3,000. We don't say 1,000 when we read the number. This is the only time we say 1,000. Uh, Jada, read me this number. 381. 381. Now, what does this tell me? What does this mark tell me here? This comma, Aiden? 1,000. 1,000. Read me the back part of this number. Read me the back part of this number, Josiah. Good. Who can read me the whole thing from start to finish? Start to finish. Savion, let's see. 381,246. Yes. Good job, Savion. I mean, yeah, Savion. Okay, so when we look at this number, this is in standard form. Standard form just means the regular form, the way that we write it, correct? Yes. Okay, can we make this number in expanded form? How would, I, how would I write this number in expanded form? How would I write it? What, would, what do I have to do, Jameer? Write the I'm going to start with the three, and I write it underneath. And then what comes after it? Zero. Fill it all the way in with zero. So how much is this three actually worth? What is the value of the three? So what is the value of the three? Elijah? It's in the hundred thousands, but how much is this actually worth? How much is it actually worth? Kyrie's? Look at this number, honey. What is this? This doesn't say 30. What does this say? 300 says what? 300 in my comma says... So the value of the three is 300,000. All right, let's drop the next one. Which one am I going to next? Tierra. Eight. I'm going to drop the eight, and then what's coming in behind it? Tierra. What am I going to fill in behind the eight? Zeros. Going to keep my comma there, too. So how much is my eight actually worth? What is that eight? What is the value of the eight? Zariah. 80,000. 80,000. Good. All right, let's keep going. I'm going to come to my next place value. I'm going to drop it. And what am I putting in behind it? Zero. All zeros. Okay. So what is the value of this one? Malia, what is the value of the one? Thousand. What is the value? That's, it's in the thousands place value. Remember, Value means a number. Place value means a word. 
What is the value of that? It's worth 1,000. Okay, let's keep going. My two. Who can raise their hand and tell me what my two is going to be worth? That's an easy one. Jamari? 200. 200. Good job. I'm coming next to my tens. What is this four going to be worth? Jaden? 40. Just 40. And then what is this six going to be worth? Ran out of room. Aaliyah? Six. Six. Okay. So what we're going to do is we are going to, we talked about standard form. We talked about expanded form. Today we're going to be talking about picture form. Okay, so on your table there are some place value mats. Table captains, can you make sure everybody gets one place value mat? And you guys may pass out the baskets. Let's see. Jaden, why don't you turn around and uh, get with the boys behind you. Okay? Just spin your chair right here. Okay, so separate the baskets. You should have four baskets for each of our place value blocks. You guys are going to work together and share all of your blocks, okay? So, and you are going to build the numbers. I'm going to write a number on the board and you guys are going to have to build it, okay? When looking at your place value blocks, I want you guys to find the basket that has this place value block in it, in front of you. You found it? You guys found it? Okay, what place value block, what does this represent? Malia, this represents the thousands, okay? All right, I'm gonna grab a different one, let's see. Find the basket that has this. Should be a long basket, good. What place value does this represent? J Jameer, the tens. Okay, how about this one, find this basket. What does this place value block represent? Savion, the ones, Jaden have a seat. Okay, and the last basket should have these in it. Gianna, what does this represent? The hundreds, okay. So I'm going to put a number on the board, and you are going to use your place value blocks in front of you. Please be careful, be sure not to mix them up, okay? When you clear off your board, put them in the correct places. You can move back here. Okay, I'm going to put a number on the board, and I want you guys to build it, okay? You ready? Okay, build that number for me. What do you need, ones? Is that what you're trying to get? Here. Count them out. You see which one's the hundreds? So what does this mean? That means 4,000. All right, good. Which one are you going to go to next? All right, which one do you need next, Savion? Six. Good job. All right, what you got, Yuzar? How much does this represent? What is this? These are hundreds? Four thousand. Four thousand. All right, and these are hundreds? How many of these do you need? Six. Six, okay. Are you working on it? Good job. What is it? You know what it is, huh? What's the small one? This is the ones. What comes next? Tens. Tens. What comes next? Hundreds. Hundreds. What comes next? Thousands. Thousands. So how many tens are you supposed to have? Two. So why did you have two tens? I'm just asking you to explain it to me. How much is this worth? Twenty. Twenty. So two tens is worth? Twenty. You have it right. Is this an even number or an odd number? And then I want you to tell me how you know. Tell me how you know. Aiden, I'm waiting for people to raise their hand. Aiden, how do you know? Because the eight is at the end. Because the eight is at the end, what do you know about an eight? How do you know? That's even. Because it got two bodies. Because it has two what? One body. So you can split it equally into two groups? Yes. Yes. Okay, good. 
Before you guys start building, can anybody read me this number? Can anybody read me the number on the board? Green table, can either one of you read me this number? Malia, you want to give it a shot? All right, what is it? All right, so now I want you to build 2,971 out of your place value blocks. And then how many hundreds are you going to put in there? Good. Save you on your going quick this time. How much is this? Let's count. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Is that what it says? All right, good. How much is this worth? Seven. One. Just one. How much is this, all this in the tens place worth? That's worth seven. So seven tens is worth how much? Ten. No, seven. Seventy. Seventy. So ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy. What is your hundreds place worth? Hundreds. Nine what? Nine hundred. And then what is this worth? Good job. You guys got it going on? Y'all good? We should all be just about done. I got a couple friends that are, have a few more pieces to put down. But how many thousands blocks did you have to put in the thousands column? Tierra? So we did two thousands blocks, right? How about hundreds? How many hundreds squares did you put in there, Leah? Nine. Nine. Oh, we're going to squeeze this in here. Okay, how about tens? How many tens did you put on your chart? Gianna? Seven. Seven. And then how many ones, Jada? One. Just one. Just one, one. Okay, good job, guys. So this is another way that we can see numbers. We have expanded form, standard form, picture form, and then who knows the last way? Jamari, do you know the last way? Yes, ma'am. It is standard form. We did standard form. Oh. We did expanded oh. form. We did picture form. Word form. Word form. Okay, so I'm going to give you a tricky one. I want you to word. clear your boards. Word. I'm going to write a number word. And then I want you to build the number word, okay? Go ahead and clear your boards. It says 3,000. 642. I want you guys to build that number. Oh, you're already you're already going. You're on a roll, girl. 3,642. Let's start at the beginning. Let's start here. 3,000. Oh, what do you hear? Oh, oh. What do you hear? Three. Three. Okay. So get three thousands. Four hundred. Six. That's forty-two. I'm going the wrong right now. I'm trying to Did it. You're done? Three thousand six hundred. Six hundred forty-two. So what do you need to go to next? Dang. Your hundreds. How many, how many do you need? Six. Okay. I'm done. You need 3,642. Read me the number you have. 3,642. Good. 3,642. Is Aiden's correct? Yes. Yes. Yes, good. One, two, three. Okay, how many hundreds blocks did you need? Tierra. Six hundred. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, how many tens did you need? Josiah? Four. How did you know you needed four tens? What word? Well, what does the word say that you're looking at? It says four. It says four? 
What does it say? 40. 40, okay? 40. If we count by tens four times, we get 40, right? So how many tens do you need? Four. Four. One, two, three, four. And then ones. How many ones do you need? You are. Two. How do you know? What does it tell you up here that says that you only need two? The word just says two, right? Our ones words are those easy words. Two. Okay, good job. Thank you for visiting our class today. We hope that you learned a little bit about place value. Adam Sanders!